And let's move right into the next round of the Novice Championship. It's time for Sweden for a second winter rally, the Udholm Swedish Rally. 13.4 Ks in length, medium difficulty, only two stars, so this should technically be easier than um, Monte Carlo. Will it be? I don't fucking know. Beautiful bastards. Who do you think you are, fucking Philip DeFranco? Bitch, I don't know. Hi, Quay. <laughs> let's, let's just move on to Sweden. Round two of the championship. The novice championship. Oh my god, that was loud. Helicopter. We can't afford to drop any points here, Amigo. We're only barely leading the championship. Are you ready? Well, yeah, because we've only done one round. That's why we're only barely leading the championship, boy. It's not a very good zero. Here we go. Let's see how I do on the snowy gravel dirt. Here in Sweden. Uh, spoiler alert, probably not that well. Because I'm not that good at this game. Oh, 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 never mind. God damn it, I thought that was like an upside down flaming car. No, it was just a regular fire. Regular little bonfire. I'm stupid. Like, I heard the retirement uh, thing from the co driver, and I thought that's what happened. Despite knowing exactly. Oh, here we go. No, it's my teammate! No! One of the Mitsu guns are. Oh, 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 we're just sliding. Alright. We are officially on the slick stuff. Grip is at a premium. Eh. Eh. Oh, we have another car out. Maybe. Yep, it's a Subaru. Slow down. Five right. Five right. Oh, right. they just Close. crashed into Three the freaking snowbank. GG. Alright, so a Mitsu and a Subaru are out on stage one. Are we going to have any more uh, problems here? Probably not. Oh, shit. Don't lift, he says. But I'm scared. Don't lift. Never lift. Flying finish. Flying over the finish. Actually, um, won the stage somehow. So, nice. I'll take that. Seventh best stage time, so I'm still slow, but hey, whatever. So let's go ahead and... Save that replay. Takes a while to save. There we go. I'm putting a lot of faith in this new memory card. I'm using it for like the first time here, so let's let's hope that it doesn't corrupt itself. You gotta push a little harder than that. Yeah, because I didn't win every sector, I don't know. So I do take the early lead over Loeb. With Solberg third, and uh, here's the rest of the results. All three Skodas right together outside the points. And it was Jean Louis Gigali and Stefan Sarazen. Keep one say Sarazen when it, that's very much not true. Sarazen. Out after one stage, so. At least I didn't destroy the engine this time, so A. I just uh, lost some brake fluid or damage the brake line, so let's uh, repair that. We can also auto repair, but now like look at the descriptions, all the stuff. Let's move on to stage two, Vargasen. 3.76 Ks, medium difficulty. Let's go. And I just realized I never opened up stream labels, so my sub count might actually go up here for a moment, or in a moment. Ooh, yeah, yeah, there it goes. Alright, stage two. Sweden. Novice. Bab mode. Are you ready? Do we have to be airborne over every jump? I mean, that's what jumps do. They they lift your car into the air. 
because of the sudden drop in uh, Slippy, of the ground. Right. It's called basic physics and gravity. Smoke flares. No, you ease off. Ah, made it. We're fine. It's fine. Have I already done damage to the brake, right side brakes again? Because the damage indicator is yellow on the right side, both right side. Uh, yeah. Somehow pulling away. Oh, oh, something's happened here. Oh, it's another Subaru. Eee, I'm in neutral. I almost crashed into the Subaru as well. So that's a, that's the second Subaru out. Subaru more like Scrubaru. Oh hi, Kini. <sighs> Hello. Oh, yep, that's that's a wall. That's a wall, now you know. Oh, he didn't tell me to not lift over this jump, so I guess... Oh, God. Good. Everything's fine. I'm still alive, although I'm pushing a little too hard now. Gotta remember to never push in this game. Car don't like that. At least with assists off. I can push without a or with assists on, but you know. Damn straight, it did. Dominated the fuck out of it. Eh. All right, so let's look at the results. I mean, I won every. I was fastest in every sector, Snow, compared to Solberg, so. Or I was faster than Solberg in every sector, so, eh, you know. So there's a stage two results. And it was Chris Atkinson this time, the other Subaru crashing. So now the lone uh, Subaru gun is Mr. Solberg, who's now in second. Past low, but I have a 19 second lead going into the final stage, so I think we'll be good. I think we'll be good. That being said, I'll probably... Fuck it. Also, another brake fluid leak. Okay. Apparently, just fucking kissing a wall damages the brake lines on this thing. Or kissing a snowbank. Anyways, final stage. Hog first. What was that? Six kilometers? A hard difficulty stage, apparently. Oh yeah, the co-driver is actually really cool. Like I said, the co-driver has a lot more um, personality in this game. Hooray. We need maximum points here if we can, okay? Uh, in real life, yes. No, in the Ready? video game, they just stay retired. But yeah, that's like an actual thing in the real WRC, and I think it's still a rule. Where, like, if you retire from a stage, you can still continue the rally, but with, at a significant time penalty. So you like, you know, don't fucking, don't win, don't pull the WRC equivalent of uh, Kyle Busch 20, what, 15? Or 16? And, like, win the rally despite not completing the stage? Yeah, let me fucking away. Dangerous driver. I'm gonna try to keep pace, but uh, no problems, this boy. Into six right. Five Mr. Co-Driver. Right. Right easy. Also, um, the pace notes are different in this two game compared to the other right. four games, WRCs. Uh, they actually like it's actually descending pace notes right. instead of ascending. So a six is now a slight bend, and a one is a very sharp turn, which is the way I prefer it. My personal preference, but hey. I thought that was also an interesting uh, thing that they would suddenly change after four years of doing it the other way. 
snow. Lots of it. Taking it easy here. Oh, oh, oh. Keep left over crest. 100. Six right. Caution. Four yeah, they had to keep two, three, uh, right. direction two notes. Looks like two, there's a little squiggle in the road. It's like, oh, keep left over this. Okay. Eh. Eh. Come on, car. Come on, Evo. It tickle. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, it actually saved that. Alright, cool. I was actually able to counter-steer that one. This game has a kind of a problem. Same problem as I experienced with NASCAR 05 and that. Um, there's certain, like... It's not as bad, but... There's definitely some uh, moments in this game where you can get into a slide and it becomes completely unrecoverable. No matter what you do. Kind of annoying. Like, kind of I mean, really annoying. Don't worry about it. I'm using the snowbank as a break. Oh, that, that's a that's a Citroen out in Fort Slope. Ah. See for Christmas. Uh, which one? The uh, Evolution or Milestone? Yay! Oh shit! I dominated that stage. Okay. You sir are a brilliant driver. Also, I just saw what Arrow said. It's like a weird mishmash of all those things, and it doesn't work. Hey, we got our next car for doing six stages. We got the we got another extreme car, the Peugeot 307. Extreme. Hooray, just unlocking cars left and right by just playing the game. That's all you gotta do, just play the fucking game. So, here are the results of the final stage. Kicked Solberg's ass. Kicked everyone's ass, actually. And yes, it was Francois Duval who retired in that stage. GG. And here are the final results. Mmm. It's so weird seeing, like, this is the final results. Just eight minutes. Like, it, it's still hard for me to uh, process that, because I'm so used to these rallies taking, like, a half an hour or more. But anyways, congrats on winning the Swedish rally. 300 more points, or unlock points. Hooray. We also got the trophy now. Panizzi. Now we get to celebrate on the podium with Solberg and I forget who the Peugeot driver was. Grunholm, maybe? I think it was Grunholm. So, anyways, it was Grunholm. Here are the updated point standings. So I now have a seven point lead over Loeb with his uh, fourth place finish. And we have 10 drivers out of 15 on the board now. With Marco Martin and y Yanni Tojino. Sure. <laughs> Joining the uh, the points club. And we've extended our uh, manufacturer's lead as well over Subaru, who's now in second. The Troy of falling to third. And yeah. So, that was Sweden. Now let's let's get out of the winter rallies, please.